as we begin 2017, there are a couple of trends that I would like to encourage us to leave behind in 2016. The first are faux freckles. Seriously, I spend most of my time actually trying to cover my flaws, whereas we have people who are manually inputting freckles on their face. And I'm sure those people who actually have freckles, who are blessed to be born with freckles, they are with me and trying to conceal all of these things. However, in 2016, that was a big trend. Hopefully no one in here took part of that. The second trend that I think we should all leave in 2016 is dabbing. <laughs> with this dabbing, it was cute. It was cute, but we are all creative. We must be able to find a new way to celebrate. Let's leave dabbing in 2016 as well. The third is actually a group of them all together. The Mannequin Challenge. <laughs> Juju on that beat. And Nay Nay. Whip that Nay Nay. Let's listen. This, this is actually the key for that. If a trend was started by a team, but yet somewhere down the line, your grandmother is participating, <laughs> it's time to let it go. <laughs> that, that, is, that is actually the key for what we're going to ditch behind. So with that, Mannequin Challenge, Juju on that beat, Nay Nay, we're leaving that in 2016. The fourth and final trend that we must leave in 2016 is photographing our food. Yes. Oh, I know, it's a millennial thing. It's a, it's a millennial thing. I can see if you're doing it on Yelp, because that's what, we, that's what we go to Yelp for, for your reviews. However, your struggle omelet that you made, we, we do not want to see, I do not want to go through my Instagram and actually see, because this is what happens. I see your struggle plate, and then because you're my friend, I'm conflicted. So am I supposed to like this? Because if I like it, then it's going to encourage you to keep posting. But if I don't like it, then your ego might actually be a little tainted. See, millennials, we got that millennial corner. She agrees. <laughs> to it. This is exactly what happens with it. So I am actually encouraging all of us, please, 2016 was an iffy year for most of us, but if we ditch these trends, I am confident that we can come into 2017 with a glorious year. We no longer need faux freckles, the mannequin challenge, the juju on the beat, the nene, nor photographing our every meal. <laughs> Madam Toastmaster.